Hello everyone, my name is David and I'm going to be showing you how to use optical character recognition to, to convert any Adobe PDF document you have into a Microsoft Word, Microsoft Excel, or even a plain text format file for editing and even more, just any versatile purposes you may need. Today I'll be using Audacity with my microphone to record audio and I will also be using NVIDIA Shadowplay, which is a hardware accelerated uh, desktop recorder um, to record my video. It's the only recorder I could find that will record 1080p resolution at 60 frames per second. And it's supported by hardware, which I've got a nice machine, as you can see here. All right, so I guess we'll move on. Um, we'll go ahead and get started with the introduction. Okay, so here's my situation. Um, I work in IT there at, at West Texas A&M University, where we're all taking this class. And I, um, I was sitting at my desk waiting for the phone to ring, you know. Um, I answer phones and I help people with their, you know, their accounts and stuff like that. Um, I'm a student technology specialist. Anyway, so every now and then my boss will come up to me with an, with an extra task, something, you know, simple and easy. He wants me to do it just to save somebody time. So what he did, he came up to me with this, uh, this scanned PDF document of a list of names and phone numbers that he wanted to put into an Excel document so that he could, you know, add email addresses to the, you know, to the end of it, to, to the next, you know, right next to the names and the phone numbers. Um, so it was a list of about three to four hundred names. I don't really, ex I don't remember the exact number, um, but it, they were all, you know, students that were, you know, going to the university. So I'm going to go ahead and do is show you how I tackled this task without actually having to enter all those names and phone numbers into an Excel spreadsheet because, you know, nobody wants to sit there and enter data for, you know, who knows how long. So let me just show you a little bit about optical character recognition. Optical character recognition is basically an algorithm that takes the pixels of a, of text basically in an image and basically converts that into you know actual text in an actual text file like a word document or an excel spreadsheet um, you can even convert it into a comma separated value uh, document you know like a regular text document for you know then you can import it to anything basically so it uses pre-processing and character recognition and post-processing to detect parse and export the you know completed text that it's found um, now in my experience uh, the only experience that I really have working with it was today and it worked great it saved me about two hours of time sitting there entering data on an Excel spreadsheet that nobody wants to go through so what I'm gonna go ahead and do is show you where you can go I mean of course there's lots of different software that you can use to um, use optical character recognition I'm sure some of it you have to pay for um, but a free simple alternative a free uh, a simple solution is we all you have to do is go to onlineocr.net it's right up here onlineocr.net and what you do is you upload your pdf document uh, your scan your email whatever it is that someone's given you that has lots of text in it that you want to transform into a word document or an excel spreadsheet and you select what language you want which english is the default but you can change it to whatever you want and you can export it in a Microsoft Word, Microsoft Excel, or a plain text document. Now these are the ones that you can do without signing up for an account on this particular website. I actually have an account because you have to have an account to do a multi-page PDF document, which I had to do. It was about five pages long. Um, so actually I signed up for an account, but you don't have to. All you have to do is upload your file, convert it, and download the, download the, you know, the respective file. So I'm gonna, what I'm going to go ahead and do is just walk you through that right now. Okay, here we go. So right now I'm going to walk you through changing a PDF document, taking the data from a PDF document, and putting it into an Excel spreadsheet without actually having to enter the data manually. Um, so what we're going to go ahead and do is open up our web browser, navigate over to onlineocr.net, and it'll bring you up this web page. Um, what you want to do is know the location of your PDF document. We're going to select a file, and we're going to select that PDF document, which is scan.pdf right here. So we're going to go ahead and upload that. Um, it'll make you fill out a capture phrase, which is 515238. This one's usually pretty easy. Um, make sure you have your language set that you want, and you have your Microsoft Excel selected. This is if you want to export the data into Microsoft Excel. Um, and go ahead and press Convert. And just give it a second and it'll give it to you in text format down here in the bottom if you want to just highlight it or you can download the output file which is what we're going to do so i'm going to go ahead and download this file 
we're going to save it to our desktop and then we will minimize that all right so now we have the output excel document right here um, and I'm gonna go ahead and open it up and see what the result is so it's not perfect just yet but we have the Excel document with the data in it that we can actually highlight and copy um, it's a predictive view we're gonna enable that again okay yeah um, so the data is here we just need to parse it into columns the way we want it which is really easy all you do is select the cells that you want to work on and then you go over to data and you go text to columns and you do delimited that's what we want because there's a space in between the name and the number and then in between the number and the next name so we're going to hit next and the delimiter would be a space and you can preview what it's going to do down here at the bottom it'll show you the line that it's going to it's going to draw so we're going to go ahead and run with that and we're going to hit finish so now what we actually have is the names in one column and the phone numbers in another column uh, I didn't actually parse this top one, so we can actually just remove that and add phone over here. So now we have the data actually parsed into um, name column and a phone column, which I just showed you how to do. It's really simple. Um, if you have any questions or concerns, um, feel free to comment down below in the uh, comment section. I'll be free to, I'll be, I'll go ahead and watch the comments and respond to any any questions you guys have. Um, basically, I just walked you through using optical character recognition to go ahead and help you get data out of images. That way you don't have to just sit, sit there and look at it and manually enter the, uh, the data that you've got. Um, again, these are fake names and fake, obviously fake phone numbers. So um, yeah, this data is pretty much just, it's all just sample data. But feel free to take this and use it in the field. And uh, if, you, if you find this useful, feel free to just comment below. All right. Well, it's been a great talking to you guys, and hopefully I'll see you again soon. All right. Have a great evening. Bye-bye.